Civil society organizations have called out the federal government for indirectly crippling the nation's health sector. While commemorating this year's International Public Service Day in Abuja, Action Aid Nigeria, in collaboration with the Public Service International and the Nigeria Labour Congress, explained that the nation's annual budget for the health sector has not exceeded 6% since 2014. They also stated that despite the nation's debt profile, the sector remains grossly underfunded. The findings from this research reveal that healthcare delivery in Nigeria has been grossly underfunded by all tiers of government. Placing the burden of health care on the shoulders of individuals and households. In the last four years, the federal government of Nigeria's budget for health had never crossed the line of 6%. In 2014, it was 5.63%, and then it grew to 5.7%. 8% in 2015. However, since 2016, the percentage of the budget for health has been on the de decline, decreasing to as low as 39 in 2018. Nigeria is spending less than 5% of, of the annual budget on health. And this has grossly promoted or pro is promoting, let me not use past tense, is promoting medical tourism among people who can pay out of pocket. And when they go abroad on medical tourism, who do they find? Nigerians. Without improvement in infrastructure for health care services, without investment in the human resource for health, and recruitment of more health workers, we may not be able to meet the sustainable development goal. 